everyone. Welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Okay, it's a little late in the month of October, but I'm going to bring you guys some Halloween nail art. I am going to be wearing black nail polish for the rest of the month, and I thought it would be fun to incorporate accent nails, um, Halloween accent nails, instead of like a whole full out Halloween mani. So I thought that would be fun, and I could um, change it up hopefully a bunch of times <laughs> between now and Halloween and give you some more ideas. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So today's video is how to make some hollow spider webs and um, I guess that's it. <laughs> I'm just make some hollow spider webs for my nails today. So it's going to be our first design. So uh, let's take a look at what the finished uh, outcome is and then we'll get into how I created it. So let's get started. First I'll be starting out with um, the Wave Gel Base Gel and then I'll be using um, a No Clean Chinese Top Coat at the end. I'm going to apply a clean slate to all my fingernails and then I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm going to use this Uber Chic plate and it's Halloween 01. And I'm going to use this um, spider web right here. I'm going to use my Moyu London stamper and scraper. And I'm going to use this stamping polish by Moira. It is pretty awesome. It's a foil polish and you use it um, to transfer foil paper instead of the glue. You can use this. It also works on pigments. I think glitters. I don't know. I've never used it on glitters. Actually, I've never, I only used it once to just to try this design out to tell you the truth. So this will be my first time actually even playing with it. It comes in silver, white, and black. And um, I'll link in the description box where you can purchase it. And I am using silver today um, because I'm going to make hollow spider webs. I took, <laughs> I redid this nail. It's got no top coat on it. And I removed the sticky layer from the, um, I removed the sticky layer from the nail polish. This, this is what I practiced on, but this is just like a plastic black tip and the hollow did not stick to it. So let's see if we can get it to not stick where it's not supposed to, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Okay, so let's see, I got the scraper here and this thing and okay. I'm going to pick up the spider web, which worked out really well, and I'm going to put it on my nail. Okay, then we're going to get the hollow powder. And we're just going to tap it on while it's still wet. Okay, it's been about a minute. And I've got my little nail brush here. And I think that worked out pretty good. Oh yeah, it didn't stick to the black at all. Woo hoo, thank you goodness. Okay, nothing like doing it wrong. I'm just gonna go over it with a little q-tip here. Perfect. All right, now I can stick my top coat on. Okay, so okay, now for the next step. I'll make sure I get all this um, glitter off or this powder off and I'll be right back. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a um, good amount of top coat on. Okay. 
Okay, and then I have these little crystals right here. I'm going to stick them on the spider web. Okay, so now I'm just going to put another top coat off over it because these aren't Swarovskis, so they'll be just fine with an extra top coat to keep them in place. Now I'm going to use this Lena plate, Spookalicious 02. Okay, now I'm going to use this little image here, Wicked, and I'm going to use my Color Club on the rocks with silver. Okay, and that actually picks up really good. And I'm just going to stamp it right here. Just going to clean up that finger, put some top coat on, and we'll come back and take a look at this. Okay, so here's the finished look. It's just really simple, two Halloween accent nails. That's it. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.